Hello Diamonds and welcome back to the Hornet Season 4. I've been working on the government building quite a bit and happily yesterday Billy came around and gave me a few items that they can use for setting everything up. So it's still a lot of progress left to do but it's taking shape. Like I even thought how it would look like in the signs what is where. And on the other side this one will change quite a bit because Bank needs to be smaller than the government office and government office will be first so bank on the back side and yeah I already have the gaze set like how to go downstairs I kind of like the idea of having a slanted edge on the staircase and it does seem to fit quite well and on the back side it's just like this <laughs> now downstairs I have set up the mint like, I do like that the machines already work without you adding any information to them. So literally you have no mint items selected or currencies or anything. And it already starts crafting. So it's kind of nice. But yeah, so this is what I've done so far. There's still loads to do. The main storage for like uh, all the loyalty rewards is in this place. I might actually need to add one more like somewhere. I mean, this I will decide later because, well, the demon might go under the staircase. We'll see how it goes. So we'll need to buy a lot of extra ingredients. I need to finish all this area. So in general, I will use lumber because it's cheaper and then compose it on the edge to give it like a little bit shading. And yeah, everything else on the floor will be lower to the Base, so it will be very high, so I don't need to worry. Actually, I already forgot if the courts are two or three high. What are they? Uh, courts. Courts are three high, so I definitely need to keep uh, keep it higher in this area. So the courts will be on this floor, uh, all of them, all six. This extra space for the seventh one, if ever needed. And yeah, other like offices and stuff will come here as well. This part will be with staircase, so it might be some special offices. So I will think about it a bit later. So yeah, there's quite a bit to do. And yeah, during the time I managed to run out of money on my tax account. So at the moment, tax account has only four Bs and therefore I was kicked out of uh, Talonera's place. But happily we have a new place that is uh, uh, giving us quite comfortable housing. So yeah, and this is made by Simi. So uh, I'm planning to go and take a look at that as well. And yeah, I, I did move in. So if I go here, you can see I'm already living there. Jim is also there. And yeah, it's set as maximum on 20, but it's actually quite good. I mean. Considering not all the floors are set up, it's already giving 100 XP compared to the Birkenhof giving 116, so not bad. Plus it's cheaper, so more money to spend. And yeah, to make more money, I think we can go to Jim's place because he needs some work done. So namely, he's often setting up work parties for, uh, for like smelting. And I did take uh, regular smelting for making my own iron bars and stuff. And yeah, as such, I have completed my seven out of seven level sevens. Oh, that's a lot of sevens. <laughs> so yeah, it's kind of good. So I don't think we will get next uh, star uh, this season because it's like nine days away and we might actually end the season like by the next week. So who knows? Anyway, I will go to Jim's place. Let's do a little bit work there. I need to pick some food as well. And then after that, we can go around and check out Jimmy's hotel to see if it's any good and what the safety standards are. So yeah, I will see you at Jim's place. So I have arrived at Jim's place and I can see that there is some type of gravitational explosion because there's a lot of different glass pieces all over the place 
So I'm not sure if Talonara will be happy or not. But yeah, this is what we have here. And yeah, of course the truck is in front of the contract boards. It's typical. But let's see. So there are two different ones. So both require smelting one. I have smelting seven, so it's totally fine. I will take this row. And let's take the copper one as well. Excellent. And yeah, it's quite a lot of uh, <coughs> extra points for that. So that's each something. So yeah, I put everything in my backpack this time. Come on. Do everything. So is that done now? Are, are the both jobs on, on the same one? Seems so. Yeah, it always says that you are not authorized to do that. <laughs> Even though it shows that you are authorized. Ah, okay. Final updated. But anyway, we did two jobs. Very quickly. And so, we managed to get a little bit reputation. And also a little bit payments. So if we go now back to our finances. You can see our main account has over 500 which is quite a good amount. And of course, our like, shop account is getting lower because, well, all the payments come to your personal account all the time. So yeah, it's actually not too bad. Plus, we now have a bit more reputation as well, I guess. Which is always nice. Even though our reputation doesn't really matter too much. <laughs> anyway, we can now quickly drive all the way to Simi's place and see what has changed in the middle. And yeah, I'm not sure if uh, in the last episode I mentioned anything about my favorite foods or not, because, well, I'm now all over the place, especially as I started to take a look at the dead speed. But yeah, I have my favorite foods and uh, least favorite foods discovered. So I did buy a few of my favorites, which is the bun shell. So, it's kind of nice. It's kind of duckle like ish. And yeah, also, I have the big truck now, just so I can do more deliveries for the uh, for the government building. Yeah, the misplaces start here. I mean, the main house, it does look fantastic from outside. But yeah, now she has made a hotel. It's slowly loading in. And as we leave here, we have proper access. Let's see. Because I remember going past it when it was in progress. So let's see. Good hotel. Comfortable housing for four persons. Social housing for plenty. Yeah, it's nice. I do like the doors. Frame glass doors. Always nice. And yeah, there's lift inside that could be used. And yeah, there's no staircases, which is much easier to build, but much harder to really take care of. And yeah, it does show that we have access as residents. So, floor two, kitchen. Let's see. Ooh, it is kitchen. Of course, there's a small way on the backside, and it's not really go through. Not sure if it's plant this way or not. It might be better to just wall it up if not in use. But yeah, it has everything necessary. You have proper seating. I do like that uh, there is use of two different types of windows. Like those have really good view. And yeah, we can later take a look at the bridge as well. <laughs> Another kitchen is just mirror image. It's quite nice. Let's go more up. I wish there was like floor setting available. It would be much nicer. But yeah, floor three is living room. And it looks quite nice. It has chimney. Wonderful. Well done, Simi. It's perfect. And I do like the look of it. Yeah. It's really, really good. Nice. And yeah, big windows on this side, big windows on that side. Really good view. And the other side is just mirror image. Again, chimney exists, which is perfect. Yeah, it always makes me happy when people 
put that detail in. Now let's check the next floor, bedroom floor. <coughs> so this is where people are supposed to sleep. And this one, you can easily go through both rooms. It's kind of good. And yeah, all the necessary that you need is here. You have the nightstand next to you, so you can put your phone or whatnot over there and then sleep. Press it doesn't need to be so close to bed, so it's all good. You have your table to like write your novels or what you want to write before sleep. And yeah, the other room is just mirror, like usual, and it looks nice. <laughs> so let's go more up. Now it should be bathroom, I guess. And it is bathroom. Let's see. This one has everything. Towels next to the bathtub. Perfect. That's always what we want. Because why why shouldn't it be like that? Toilet is also available next to the sink. Unfortunately, the sink is a bit further away from the towels, but I think it's fine. Like It's only like a few steps. Yeah, after pass, you need more to towels than after washing your hands. So it's all good. And the other one, as always, just mirror image. So yeah, not too many things inside, but ah, this one is missing towels. So yeah, if you have to use this uh, bathroom, then a little bit out of luck, but it's not the worst. Hopefully we can have some more in the future. Then floor six, again, living room. So those are not fully finished yet because it takes a lot of resources to do that. So, so I understand Simi was kind of running low on ingredients, especially as the building is made out of composites. So super expensive, but still like we can see that the fireplace is properly done and the second one as well. So it's all very good. And yeah, trying to keep both sides kind of similar. Excellent. What's next? Another bedroom. So those bedrooms are a bit more simple. There's no nightstand in those, but otherwise they look totally good. So not too much trouble. I mean, you can easily sleep in them. So that's good. Next floor is bathroom. Let's see what's here. I mean, we have the toilet, last up but again no towels same on this side so that's a little bit sad but i mean it's pretty much bring your own towels in this case so it's more like probably social housing type another kitchen so this kitchen doesn't have table but it does have many other things that you might need which is good same on this side so the higher we go, the less items we can find. <coughs> Let's see what's next. Next, there is absolutely no rooms. So we have arrived to the top of the building. So let's let it come all the way. And yeah, on this floor, we can go outside and see what it looks like. So it's very interesting uh, structure. It does give very unique vibes with that angle. It kind of reminds me of some big buildings in London. So yeah, that's good. And yeah, it goes all over the uh, roof. And yeah, it looks quite nice. On those, I, I would probably put one of the stop pieces also here to make it a bit more continuous, like it is down there. But yeah, it's it's really nicely made. I do like it. So yeah, well done, Simi. You definitely know how to design everything. And yeah, we'll send the lift back down because we don't need it to go down. We are going to jump off the building. So it reminds me actually, Yes Man, where the main character had to jump off the bridge because, well, he said yes to everything. But yeah, it's, it's really nice. So let's jump down and then we can take a look on that bridge that is not finished yet but it looks kind of nice so woohoo so yeah of course we touch the floor so if it was real life we would be in really big trouble by now happily it's echo so no worries 
So I will leave my truck there. And yeah, I can't even read the name there, but anyway. So it does look really nice. Mortar stone. It's all good. Big room here. Not sure what it will be used for. But yeah, the design is really nice. I do like the design. On the other side, there is staircase. Wow. So let's head up and check out what's over here. I think there will be some tower on this side as well. Interesting floor. Tiny holes for your keys to fall in. Big room again. And then way into the tower. Again, big room. And then finally, the top floor. Oh, we jumped off nicely. And yeah, the other side of the bridge doesn't seem to be as much finished. Not sure if it's supposed to, because, well, I don't know what is being built. Ah, a payment for the hotel. Nice. And yeah, again, on one side, they, ha they have the staircase. So yeah, I think it will be very similar to what we have there. But yeah, really well made. It looks nice. Actually, I'm not sure who is making the those bridge buildings here. But regardless, it's really well made. So yeah, in this section of the map, we have many fantastic buildings and, and as I know, mainly by Simi. So yeah, I hope Simi will join next season as well and makes really nice, wonderful places. And maybe after the next season, we can have new current building by her. Who knows? But yeah, so this is pretty much what I wanted to take a look at today. And I uh, hope everyone else enjoyed the quick check on those buildings as well. So thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.